We know that uh, the gap between the platform and trains is uh, a very old problem and uh, it's not easy to solve. From the platform to the train, this horizontal and vertical gap are still there and we don't have any other solution than using the foldable ramps. The ramp demonstration involves participants coming in to trial the ramps and then give their opinion of how it might change the way that people with a disability may be able to access the public transport. My experience here today was uh, the solutions, the AMAR and the DMAR concepts provided me, my, myself and my guide dog, very smooth access into and out of the uh, prototype uh, conveyances that were provided here today. It's important that people with disabilities can maintain an autonomous lifestyle. You know, if we can integrate this technology into the train, it's good for us, it's good for disabled people, you know, for their independence. I think it's very important because everyone needs to feel safe and have equal accessibility to the public transport system. The Department of Transport has a vision around simple, safe, connected journeys. Making all our journeys accessible is absolutely core to our vision and what we're aiming to achieve as a state. We are very grateful for NTRO for taking the initiative to solve this problem. Um, so we are really grateful to be involved. NTRO is playing a critical catalyst and sponsor of this particular innovation. We have the opportunity to bring together potential end purchasers from a governmental perspective to take advantage of this innovation. We're always available to have a conversation on how we can help others bring their innovations to life.